Good morning, leaders. Thank you for um, teaching this Sunday, November 17th. We are following Pastor Mark. He's speaking on generosity out of 2 Corinthians uh, chap chapter 8. Oh, I just can't read. Chapter 8, verses 9 through 15. Uh, oh, no, I wrote it on here this way because it's chapters 8 and 9, different verses from each chapter. Anyway. Mine matters a little bit. Uh, talking about the Macedonian church and the Corinthian church and how they were giving and things like that. So we're going to uh, keep all the kids together unless we have like gobs of them. Um, for the teaching time, I'll just kind of split the room in half just for visual sake. They're not going to go anywhere. And uh, I, you, teachers, um one half of the room will be the Macedonian church. One half of the room will be the Corinthian church. Uh, verses will be on the screen. I'll do that in a minute. And um, they'll just, they're kind of kind of respond, paying attention to the verses as we read them when it's their church that's being referred to. And like bonus points if their faces or they acted out or something like that. I'm not sure what the bonus points will get them, but somebody will be in charge, you probably, of calling those out because, you know, that makes it more fun if something actually happens. Uh, then we are going to split them. We'll get the fifth graders in a group, fourth graders, blah, blah, blah. And um, as we've done in the past, we will let the youngest kids then go uh, pull teams. So that we end up with, I believe Nikki has set us up at Hillside for five or eight, several teams. We'll know by then. Um, and... Huffman, I think, has two game boards. So uh, you'll split into two teams over there, multiple teams over here. And the the point is they need to be mixed ages. Um, so probably you're not going to have two buddies together. You might. You might end up with that if we have that many older kids or whatever. But um, split them up by ages because we need the older to help the younger too. Um, but also it's just a practice in, hey, we mix it up. We all matter and we all get along. So we're going to uh, split them up. They are each going to have a game board and money and a pack of pieces. So there's a dice and then there's little pawns in there. She's a really good job. Um, and the game boards all have the same thing. They don't all look exactly the same, but they all have the same spots on them. Things like, oh no, the dog ate the groceries, pay $2, payday, get $2, rent is due, pay $3, those kinds of things. And then options of, hey, there's somebody that you heard about who needs something. Do you choose to give or not give? That kind of thing. Um, there should be enough money in each stack um, that the players have enough to make the game work on each board. But that is that is the bulk of the lesson is coming together, playing this game, and then we'll kind of debrief the game a little bit at the end. So we will need the adults in the room to help during the game time, keeping it moving, answering questions, all that kind of stuff. They'll have seven to 10 minutes to play the game because frankly, I have no idea how long it'll actually take. I just make things up. So it uh, should be fun, different way to do lesson. Uh, and I'm looking forward to it. I'll see you Sunday. Thanks.